Welcome back to Community Hotline. My name is Monica Weitzel. We're here in Gresham at Metro East Community Media. And now we're going to talk about a fun event that's going to be going on in the community, one you may want to check out. I know I want to. We're going to be talking with the Larch Mountain Country Artisans. They have a big show coming up and representing the Larch Mountain Country Artisans. We have Starlena Simon. You're in charge of publicity and you are with Leaning Star Winery. And Nancy Tingley, uh, you're in charge of hospitality and you're with Shooting Star Designs. Thanks for being here, both of you. Thank you. Thank you. So how long have you two been involved with, uh, with Large Mountain Country Artisans? Is this new to you this year or you, have you done this for a while? This is my first year back, ah. but previously I had worked with them for three or four years. Is that right? Yeah. And, and doing what? I mean, are you, are you an artist yourself? I, I make the wines. and. Of That's recent. an art right there. <laughs> <laughs> they, they're, you know, I like to use local fruit, and uh, um, we kind of use our own stuff from where we live now, and, and it's kind of evolved. It's kind uh, of evolved, and, and as well, I've started doing my, a lot more of my own art, and I, I love, <laughs> I love painting, and it's yeah. just, just a lot of fun. So, do you show your art in this show? I or, or actually use it. Right I actually use it on the labels. The labels. Yeah. yeah, I've seen that. Um, and we'll get back to that. Okay. Um, uh, Nancy, you have been involved with the Large Mountain Country Artists for how long? I just looked it up and I believe I've been going for 10 years. I've had wow. a, a booth there. So who can tell so, me how this all started? How did this organization come to be? Well, as I understand, there was a group of artisans that got together years ago. And it started and they ju would just have a show in a barn. Oh. And okay. I would imagine Somewhere around it was probably kind of cold. <laughs> Somewhere around large Yeah, mountain, I would Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, then now, since then, they've moved out to where they are. And so what, where, is, where is the location now where they have It's the... at Glen Auto Park. In, oh, okay. Down there in Troutdale. Right. Down right. by the down river. Down at the bottom mm -hmm. of the hill there, mm -hmm. right before you cross the Sandy River. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, um, so this is a once a year event? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. And so how many artisans are involved in this? Do you know? Have any um, idea? That's a good question. I would... Maybe, Maybe around 30? 30. Mm -hmm. That's what I was okay. going to say. Yeah. And what kinds of art can people expect to see? Well, that's what I like about the show is that there's a good variety. I used to um, have another show I did at the similar time, but all of the artwork was so similar. Uh, and in this after show... After nothing stands out. <laughs> right. In this show, everyone has something a little different. They don't want people to have exactly the same thing. So it's such a good variety. And so painting and mm -hmm. pottery and, mm -hmm. and jewelry. Pottery and, jewelry and, and, uh, and there's a lady that does paper mache. She's quite popular. Oh. Uh, paper mache people and birds. Oh, and fun. Glass, and maybe, mm -hmm. metal. Yep. Oh, yeah. Sculptures. There's glass, mm -hmm. Pottery, there's, yeah. I was um, reading through a bunch of the bios of the people, and I was like, oh, my goodness, these people have a lot of experience. Oh, they have a, they have a pedigree. Then. Yeah, <laughs> they really do. And, wow. and I yeah. think a lot of the artisans as well have evolved. They okay. start and they do a little something and then do more. These pictures that they're showing up here on the screen now, these are some of the, um, mm -hmm. some of the works of some of the artists uh, mm -hmm. that you'll have there. So Yeah, so the one on the right there, Robin Cicilline, she does some candles and she does soaps. It. She does really beautifully herbal herbal scented soap. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's called Spruce Hill. Mm. And uh, nice. then Lori Harrell does the stuff up there on the left. And I think she does quite a bit of stuff, thing art that that reflects nature. Uh, and okay. I, I'm just in awe of it. <laughs> And uh, um, this is Nancy Smith. Oh, um, I know Nancy, yeah, photographer. She does yeah. nature photography. Mm -hmm. She does yes. beautiful mm -hmm. work. Yeah. And calendars. Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 Yeah, I've, I've often, very often have her calendars on my walls. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that. And that's the same with soap from Robin. Mm -hmm. The same person who did the candles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then Mike Smith um, did, did the that other. really cool thing. Yeah, that I think cool. he also did that, that basket there on the right. That's great. And uh, Alexander, uh, oh, more wood. I can't yeah, remember that. Yeah. yeah. And and that's wood on the left there? Yeah. It's, oh my goodness. Is that, is that? It, I don't know. Yeah, I think Randy it's Randy Rines. Mm -hmm. And it's just amazing how oh, is he it, puts is that small wood or together. I can't tell by this. I am not sure. Is. Wow. Um, we have some charcoal work. And nice. then I, like I can't quite see what that is on the left. <laughs> and it looks. Is that Joanne Sharon's 
I'm not sure. I'm not sure. And that's Sarah Lowe. Mm -hmm. Lowe. Pretty. Mm -hmm. oh, wow. On Lovely. the left. Mm -hmm. Wow. Sarah Lowe on the left. And um, that's interesting. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not sure. Maybe Dulce. It could Maybe. be Dulce. Possibly. People Possibly. Have to come and check it out. Oh, we have some whimsy here. Too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's some more of Sarah Lowe's, and she lives here in Troutdale, and and she does a lot of art also that reflects um, different places here in the city. Like the which Oregon is coast, cool. yeah. yeah. And, uh, um, that's a scene you won't see any time in the next few days, will you? You yeah. won't be sitting out in chairs like that. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be cold and icy, but that... More woodwork. I like that. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's you know, that's great. So there's a real variety. And uh, now, um, Nancy, you brought some of your artwork today, yes. too. And I'd love to show um, our viewers some of this, if I could. This is a trillium, which when you go hiking here around, sorry, around uh, yes. Oregon, uh -huh. you often find the trillium. But what I understand is you're not supposed to dig them up. They're, no. They're, it's against the law, I think. No. It takes many years for them to get to yeah, where like they are. And if you dig them up, they don't come back. Yeah. So... Um, I like to uh, hike in the woods and photograph and then work from my own photographs. Oh, it's beautiful. And I do a lot of botanicals. Ah, uh, yes. This and some beautiful. landscapes, which... Oh, this is a uh, yeah, Crown Point, beautiful. is that...? Yeah, that's Vista House, Crown Point. Yeah, I love that. Yeah, I love from, that view. Thank you. It looks like it's up like from like Manuka. Have you been up to Manuka yeah, before? Yeah, I've been to Manuka. I think this is from the viewpoint there, the, oh, okay. the yes, Women's yes, Forum okay. viewpoint. Oh, yes, right, right. Yeah. That's so, really nice. And then the last one you have is? Is uh, obviously Timberline Lodge. <laughs> which anybody who lives here or has been here should know Timberline yes. Lodge, but that's beautiful. Yeah, I was commissioned a few years ago by uh, Timberline Lodge to do that. Really? So, do they use it, it on like cards and things um, like that? I have, or yeah, know? I do uh, note cards also yeah. with all of these. They're beautiful. Yeah, and it's, uh, it's the original, um, Timberline Lodge is now gray. But I have the original oh, old color yeah, from right. the back. You're right. I like yeah, that. Same lodge. <laughs> so you'll have um, your paintings there. Yes. And you'll be there. Will you be there then for people to talk to? Yes. So will yes. most of the artisans be there with their work? Most of them will be. Yeah. Um, not all. They it sort of rotate in and out. Some people stay the whole time. Yeah. So. A lot of it, just real quick too. It's it's a co-op, and so everybody kind of has things they need to be doing during the show to help uh, it right. run smoothly. Oh, and so, so everybody works maybe together. Maybe be at their table for a little while and then there will be times when they have to be somewhere else. Yeah. Okay. Right. So um, this is November 21st, 22nd, and 23rd, yeah. correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now your wine, you're you selling it there or you, uh, do they have wine tasting there? They, what do you have going no, on? We're not going to have wine tasting. Okay. Um, but they will be there and well, they will be for sale. bottles here. But I just happen to have next to my hand. <laughs> so this one is a leading star. And so you do this actual artwork here. I didn't do this one. This one is from a lady. Her name's Carrie Hubbard. She's an artist that she lives out in Estacada now. And um, that's yeah. Oregon pear honey wine. Yeah. Yum. yeah. <laughs> Sounds really good. We have honeybees. And so we'll oh. use some of our own honey. We use um, a lot of our own fruit. Wow. And so, yeah. so this one is boysenberry. Yeah. Sounds good. Yeah. And, and is this part, is this your artwork or is, are any of these? Nope. Nope. No? How about but this, this one? one is. This one is. This one okay. is. <laughs> this is the Oregon Hard Knocks. So yeah. Like that. And yeah. And it's, it's an apple honey wine. It was actually made with a little lavender. Oh. And so, yeah, a lot of my wines are very, um, craft oriented. Yeah. It's yeah. not really something you're going to find too much of. No, uh, it's, these are common else. wines. However, this one is a Merlot with honey. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you that picture here. <laughs> so you can see that. That's, that's, that's great. Yeah, and that's actually a, a painting that I got from a lady there at Large Mountain is that right? show a, a few it's, years back ago. And so now you use it on your, mm -hmm. on your wine bottles. Yeah. See, so people, if they want to get this wine, they also have a lovely bottle. They mm -hmm. can just keep it later, put their flowers in it. <laughs> <laughs> there you I go. Like this. Yeah. People, uh, it's kind of funny. It's um, They've always done very well, the, the wines at the show, mm -hmm. even though people can't taste them, just wow. because people enjoy the art. Yeah. Well, they enjoy the art, and, and it's, it's it's kind of an Oregon-centric yeah, thing. It reflects you know? Oregon. Yeah, it reflects yeah. the, the bounty that we have here. Yeah. So that's, that's pretty nice. Nice. Mm -hmm. So what else can you tell me about, you know, the short amount of time we have left, tell me, what else can you tell me about the, the event itself? Um, it's, 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 it's a very well attended. Is it? Good. Yes, there's usually a line outside waiting when oh, really? the doors open. Okay. At, I believe it's one o'clock on Friday. Yeah, and um, a lot of people come back every year because 
they want to come back and get the same things they had before. Uh, and it's a great and place for people to do their holiday shopping. Holiday shopping, yes. The timings couldn't be so perfect. So we can recognize be <laughs> several of the same people. Yeah. yeah, so there's a good several thousand people that come. Wow. So and you always have it at the same place at Sam Collins yeah. building? Yes. Yeah. As long as I've known it's been really? at that, at that, at that place. location. Um, but as well, the the um, Larch Mountain, Ar Mountain Artisan Group, it does benefit a lot of the arts in the area. That's what, um, That was my question. Now, what are some of the, so it doesn't benefit solely the, the artisans. No, it benefits no. uh, different nonprofits. Yeah. There's um, uh, the arts at Corbett. There at Corbett is, School. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, there's an arts program through um, the city of Troutdale. And they'll give, they'll give grants and, the, and, and scholarships. Yeah, right. Vista House. Right. Um, I think there might be one more, but um, yeah, I yeah, remember there was, just, there was another one. I can't remember what it is now, but um, but they're all local mm -hmm. organizations yes, yeah. that benefit from mm -hmm. it, and yeah. mostly arts related, yeah. but not solely. Yeah. yeah, I think they'll they normally also have a display of the high schoolers' arts. Yes, they yeah. do at this event. Mm -hmm. at the, yes, oh, mm -hmm. on the back oh, wall. Nice. It's always really nice. So, so, so the they local can aspire art. to be part of the large mountain yes. country artisans. When the they kids are awesome. Yeah, yeah they do really good. Work. I know, I'm sure they do. I'm sure they do. Is theirs for sale as well? Do you know? I don't think so. Is there what? They're, for sale. Their Is artwork it? for sale. I don't think so. It's just on display, as I remember. Yeah. So somebody you can watch for as they get older. And there's they? Yeah. quite a few of them up yeah. on display. Right. So um, when people go to the event, then they can go. They can purchase art. They can mm -hmm. buy art. There's no food at the at this event, correct? Nah, they might have some cookies or something. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, so, we try to keep everyone in line um, happy, yeah. so we try to serve them coffee and cookies. Oh, you do while they're well, if they have to wait in line for oh, that's nice. too long. That's nice. Yeah, yeah I appreciate yeah. it when people do that. But, yeah. You know, going to Trowdale. Trowdale's a really cute community anyway. So go in there and yeah. you know, have lunch at one of their restaurants and yeah. you know, work your way down to the down to the park. Uh -huh. Yeah, I like it down there. I like I like Troutdale. I think it's a really a nice place. And it's very festive looking for the holidays yes, in the yes. woods and the fir trees yeah, and everything. Yeah, mm -hmm. good. Yeah. Um, before you go, what um, are there other things that go on during the year for for the artisans? Or is is this just your one? This is your one big shebang there for the is year. One more. What is it? It's in there at the high school. At and, the um, oh, the um, Columbia Gorge. Yeah. Yeah, Columbia Gorge Art uh, Festival. Art Festival. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. At which high school is um, it? Corbett. Uh, oh, it's, oh it's, at, it's at the grade school. Is it at the grade school? Oh, right. right. It's, it's at the grade, grade school. school. That's a real artsy community right it there, is. isn't yes, it? it is. Corbett, yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Great. Well, and there I, is also someone that does jams and jellies, and there's samples of the jam and jelly. Oh, well, there you go. Oh, yeah. yeah, and it's really good. I bet it, <laughs> <laughs> I bet it is. So um, this is November 21st, 22nd, and 23rd. So that's yes. uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. And do you both plan on being there a little bit every day? Or I do. I do. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you are now Mal, pronounced yeah. man and wife. <laughs> Usually there most of the time. <laughs> yeah. Well, um, I am looking forward to it. I think um, I don't. I can't make it out every day, but I'm gonna try to get out <laughs> at least one of those days. So it sounds like a great place to do some of my shopping and, yeah. and uh, try to resist buying all the stuff for myself. So <laughs> thanks right. very much. Any last words You're you want to share with us, or oh, just come and come and come visit and, and shop and have a good time. Sounds good to me. Okay, thanks very much, both of you, for being right. on. Thank, Thank you. you. And if you want more information, you can um, go to the uh, website, lmca-artisans.com, and check it out. They have some gorgeous, gorgeous artwork there. I'm Monica Weitzel. Don't go away. We'll be right back with more of Community Hotline. Mm -hmm.